morning. Time for the Goldwing update. I spent some time this week trying to get this thing to run. You know, so I rebuilt the carburetors. That's all put back on. Clean, ready to go. New plugs. Uh, trying to get the thing to, to, to start. I have this battery. I charged it up. Connected it with the jumper cables, but it, the connection just isn't tight enough. This thing pulls a lot of amps. So went to Walmart, picked up a couple of four gauge leads, and connected it direct. And now I get good. Uh, you know, it before it was just clicking. Now it turns over like a bear. So that's all fine. Then so now the last thing is I have to feed it gas. Right? Can't use this tank. I mean. It's just, it's gross in there. So, I thought I had it all figured out. I had this, this is the old expansion tank for the radiator. I was just going to put some gas in there, run that line down. But the, uh, you know, I'm not going to need an expansion tank afterwards, or I'm not going to use it. I found this uh, radiator fluid that does not expand when it gets hot. It's uh, special stuff, expensive, but put it in once and that's it. Um, so I was just going to use this, hang it upside down, hang it from this little wire over here and feed the gas. But the cap, it leaked, you know, and it's all warped here. I mean, I even made a gasket and tried that. On it. I just couldn't get it to work. So then I go to uh, feast <laughs> at this little water bottle. I heated up the hose and stuck it in a, a slightly smaller hole seemed to work I held it upside down with the water didn't leak but then when I went to hang it and manipulate it to hook it up it, you know wiggling it around just had gas all over the place last night so on to plan C I uh, couldn't think of anything I picked up some of this junk I'll probably put it in my truck empty it out but what I need is the tip I'm gonna Take the take this hose, heat it up, slide it onto there, put a little light clamp on it. I'm hesitant about clamping on an angled surface, but maybe I could if I could find a coupler, metal coupler, I could slide it in the middle and then clamp up the whole assembly. But anyway, I'll be able to do that, and then I'm gonna take this. I cut up an old spray bottle. So I hang it like that. And then I just gotta feed the gas. So that's that's where it's at. All I want to do is hear the thing run, and then I can start tearing it apart. But that's the progress so far. Keep you updated. <laughs>